Hello guys, welcome back to another Boom Beach video. Wow, this thing is not working. Okay, welcome back to another Boom Beach video. Today, you guys have asked for it for pretty much forever. And finally, guys, I am going to be using the skank strategy. I used this a long time ago, but you guys wanted me to use it again. I don't know why, but we are just going to be taking out Dr. T. And you can see there that the Mega Crab hasn't came back for me yet. I mean, no, it's, it hasn't came out for me yet. That's because I am on vacation currently, and I'm pre-recording all these videos. So, yeah, I'm pre-recording all of these videos. So, this is like the day of the Mega Crab, and it comes out in like six hours. So, I'm really hyped. I didn't see what Dr. T said. Dang it. Okay. Was it something important? I don't know, but we'll see eventually. Um, and yeah, so yeah, it hasn't come out for me yet, so I haven't really been able, well, I'm just, I'm just recording videos because I'm bored and I'm on spring break, but, uh, I'm really hyped, and I, I need to record, like, 14 videos in a week, so, I mean, it's not that bad, that was a fail, I did not mean to do that at all, I can't wait, though, we're gonna get a ton of loot, we're gonna get a ton of upgrades done, and even in that three-day period, we are going to get some upgrades finished and stuff like that, but, I am really hyped. I can't wait. It's going to be a ton of fun. And yeah, Mega Crab, guys. I, I honestly don't think it's fair that some people will get it before us and I get it like last. It's just kind of annoying. Um, well, it's totally fair because I live in the US, but I mean, like, I, it's just like not. I don't like it because I'm a YouTuber and I want to post videos on it. And it gets, it's like bad because I get a last. So there's pretty much all the YouTube videos out. People up to stage 30 even before I get to it. That was a fail. So it's just, it's just really annoying as a YouTuber. <laughs> like as a Boom Beach player, it's not that big of a deal. But as a YouTuber, it is. So, I mean, I really do hope they do something about that in the future. I mean, they could always switch it up. Like today, it's... The, uh, like next time then New Zealand gets it last and it's like opposites that might be kind of hard to do but it would just be a lot more fun if they switched it up I know why they don't want to bring, bring it out at the same time for everyone that's because some people will be getting it late at night some people will be getting it in the morning some people will be getting it wow they're gone but 6 a.m. then 6 p.m. it's perfect for everyone people are home um, and also it gets rid of server spam basically their servers get overloaded and yeah it just it, it clears some of it up because as soon as mega crab comes out everyone wants to be playing it so that's why they do switch it up so like the servers don't like overload anything okay here we go we are moving into the base here and uh yeah we're just gonna drop some barrages around the area and take out every single defense around here and let's just fly to the HQ because we can just finish off this base just like powerhouse it down and yes grab all that nice loot that we surely want from Dr. T so we got a lot of gold which is very nice I mean why don't you want gold gold is amazing everyone wants gold even pirates like gold everyone likes themselves some good gold Okay, we're going to drop our tanks first, like that, and dang it, we're going to shock that. I don't want to lose any tanks. Uh, I should have thought about that when I landed. I didn't lose any. Some of them got kind of wounded. I'm trying to avoid putting my tanks on the, the right side over there, because there was that other boom cannon, so, I mean, it worked out very well for me, but it could have ended very bad, very, very fast. Okay. We are going to take down this boom cannon. And as soon as that boom cannon goes down. One more maybe. Yeah. As soon as that boom cannon goes down. We're going to be doing a flare over here. Smoke. Smoke. And I would even going to go even further over here. Just to avoid all of that. Because look at those two. Those two scorchers were almost dead. So. I mean it feels good to save a scorcher life. Scorcher life matters, guys. Scorcher lives matter. Okay. Who drives a Scorcher? A drunk grenadier. That is the question a lot of people ask, but we do know that a drunk grenadier drives a Scorcher. Because, well, grenadiers and Scorchers have two things in common. 
they could kill their own troops and they run all over the place they're both drunk um, so it's kind of obvious the clues are all around us and it's just time for us to accept the fact that the grenadier is driving the scorcher it's just time okay <sighs> oh gosh how am I going to do this I do not know I mean I could flank the base avoid all of this stuff over here off a flame but I could flank it this way also and avoid the boom cannon and the cannons um, I'm gonna go on the right side because I want to take out the boom cannons first and I could shock all of those so it wouldn't be nearly as bad one blah, 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 blah. shock and we are just gonna be moving in I'm not very good at this strategy guys I've never really got to the hang of tanks I just don't like tanks at all um, so I just really never gotten to learn how to use them but I do know how to use scorchers I love myself some nice scorchers so that's nice I do know how to use scorchers um, the scorcher over here is getting plumbled gosh okay uh, I, I should do be doing a reflood back but Everything is looking pretty good right now, but we are going to do it anyway. I do not want to lose any right now, guys. <laughs> I do not want to lose any. Okay. We're going to be dropping some critters on the boom cannon. And hopefully the boom, it will distract the boom cannon. It did. One hit. Um, but that's, that's good. We're just trying to save our scorches. We don't want to lose any. This is a very, very, very powerful strategy, guys. Very powerful. And with great power comes great, no, with great responsibility comes great power. Or it doesn't, is it, I don't know, is it the other way? I'm going to lose, like, all my Scorchers, but one. Dang. Okay. We're going to be doing a flare up here. And then we're going to be flying to the HQ. I shouldn't have used that flare to drop a smoke, but that is fine. And we are going to lose some tanks, which is not fine because tanks are really expensive and that kind of stinks. Look at that flame just going ham on those tanks, just rocking them all. Dang, that's rough. Okay. Um, we will beat the base. That Scorcher will probably explode at the very last second, of course. And then the boom cannon will take out a few. But we were able to take down the base with only losing four tanks and four scorchers not bad we got two crystals which is very nice uh, i can't be mad oh he just said what he said last time so i nearly two years into this campaign that is true that's a long time two years wow wow <laughs> just makes you reflect and i got it about four months after the soft launch so in about i don't know four months I'll be hitting my four, no, about two months, actually. Yeah, two months after the soft launch. So in about two months, guys, I'll be hitting my one-year anniversary. Maybe I'll be 100% max by then. I guess we'll just see. I guess we will just see at all. Okay. Um, I really do want to finish that off. Is there an easy NPC base around this area? Nailed. Is nailed easy? I could take down. Okay, yeah, I could take that down with a few tanks. First, we'll take down the boom cannons because those are pretty much one shot. My tanks, or maybe a two shot, probably two shot. Boop, boop, boop. So we got three, six, seven, eight, eight tanks. We're gonna just avoid that total left side and just go in from the top and hopefully beat the base. Okay. Um. We don't need to use anything yet. We will drop some critters just to do some distractions because those sniper towers alone, they're not that bad. But in groups, that's when they get pretty deadly. Okay. Uh, we'll take down these two. And then we'll do the flare up here. And we'll do a shock, a med kit. And that should be good we may lose a few more but that is fine because after this battle i'm not going to log on we're just going to open a supply chest so i mean if you think about it eight scorchers versus an npc base not bad at all if i had medics i wouldn't have lost any 
So that's why you should bring medics. I only lost one, which isn't that bad. They cost like, is it 15,000 a piece? I believe it's 15,000. They should be like, <laughs> they should be like 30,000 a piece, but 23,000, 23, that's pretty expensive. Okay, we need iron. So we'll grab the iron. We got three intel. Look at this guy's, his task force has so much intel. I have a grand total of 177 intel in a two week period, which is insane. Anyway, guys, I hope you liked this video. If you did, be sure to drop a like. As always, I'll talk to you guys in the next one. Bye.